While configuring your Synology NAS, you may have noticed two folders that have very similar names. If we open File Manager, you can see that we have both a Home and a Homes folder. However, as we did not create these folders when we configured our NAS, you might be wondering what these folders are for and why they were created. If you are familiar with the Linux operating system, you may have seen these folders before. However, for Windows and Mac users, seeing both a Home and Homes folder can be a little concerning, especially if you're in the process of familiarizing yourself with your new NAS. On both macOS and Windows 10, you will find a folder in the root of your hard drive called Users. This folder will contain the profiles for any user accounts that have been created on that computer. On a Synology NAS, while the Homes folder performs a similar function to that of the Users folder in macOS or Windows 10, because a Synology NAS has been specifically designed to share data, the folders in Homes are created to allow the users of our NAS to have a personal network share that cannot be accessed by any other user of our network. As our administrator's account is simply a user account with elevated access permissions, our administrator's account will also have its own home folder, which you can see here. However, in order to perform certain tasks, such as make a backup or scan files for viruses, our administrator's account needs to have full access to all of the data stored on our NAS, including access to any of the folders found in Homes. As the Homes folder is simply the parent folder to any of the Home folders that were created for the users of our NAS, our administrator's account is able to see both a Home and Homes folder. To demonstrate this point, if we log into this station manager using a standard user's account, if we once again open File Station, you can see that as a standard user, we are only able to see a home folder for this user. If on your NAS you do not see either the Home or Homes folders, more than likely your NAS simply has not been enabled with a service called User Home. This is because by default, a Synology NAS does not enable User Home service. If you remember back to when we first set up our NAS, one of the options within the Setup Wizard allowed us to choose to automatically install a number of default Synology applications. As both the Moments and Drive packages need to have User Home service enabled, if we choose to automatically allow our NAS to install these applications, the Setup Wizard will also enable User Home service, which in turn creates the Home and Homes folders. However, if we choose not to automatically install Synology's default applications, then User Home Service will not be enabled and we will not see a Home and Homes folder when we view FileStation. If you want to check to see if User Home Service is enabled on your NAS, if from within this station manager you choose Control Panel, then User and select the tab Advanced. Under User Home, you will see an option that allows you to enable User Home service and choose which volume the Home and Homes folders will be created on.